readers, you remember last week when we took that field trip um, to the window and we noticed things that we had never noticed before? Well, I've been your reading teacher all year and I bet that there's still things you don't know about me. For example, did you know that I have six sisters and one brother, right? Big family. I want you to go ahead and pause the video and turn and talk to your partner and tell them something that they may not know about you. Go ahead and pause the video. All right, readers, listen, we've known each other for a very long time and there are still new things that we can learn. So today I wanna teach you that when we reread a story, we don't just learn new things about the story, we also reread and learn more about the characters as well. Why don't you read Mr. Putty and Mr. Putter and Tabby Drop the Ball with me? And we're gonna reread, and as we reread, we're gonna learn some new things about the characters, all right? Here we go. Baseball. Mr. Putter and his fine cat Tabby love to nap in the summertime. They love napping in the garden. They love napping on the porch. They love napping in the car. Wow, readers. The first time I read this, I remember that Mr. Putter and Tabby, they love napping. But now that I'm rereading, I'm learning that they like to nap everywhere. Let's keep going. It seems that we nap all the time, Mr. Putter said to Tabby one day. Tabby was old and her frisky days were over. She loved napping. I think we need a sport, said Mr. Putter. Tabby opened one eye. Ooh, rereading this page has got me thinking. It says that Tabby was old, so that's probably why she likes to nap. Maybe Mr. Putter likes to nap also because he's old, and that's what old folks do. Young folks do it too, because I'm not that old and I love my naps. <laughs> Let's keep going. I think we need baseball, said Mr. Putter. Tabby opened the other eye. I wonder where my old mitt is, said Mr. Putter. He headed to the basement. Tabby was wide awake now. Why don't you go ahead and pause the video and let's see if you can notice things that you've never noticed before. Go ahead and pause the video. All right, so something that I've noticed is, last time I read this, I seen that they had a lot of different activities like bowling balls and biking and rollerblading and things like that, but it said in the book that he wanted to call Mrs. Teaberry because she's sporty. And seeing all these different sports equipment make me think that Mr. Putty, Mr. Putter is sporty too. Readers, did you see that? Or shall I say re-readers? When you reread books, you learn so much more about your characters. So today when you go off to read, be sure to mark places in your book that you've reread and notice something new so you can teach your partners about it. Off you go, readers. Bye.